Winter Girls Leah Overbrook, an 18-year-old girl, just found out that her ex-best friend Cassie has died. Cassie had called Leah 33 times the night of her death. However, Leah never answered the phone. Cassie was found in a hotel room, killed by her illness, bulimia. Leah, who has a history of anorexia, falls into a downward spiral of self-harm and calorie counting. To hide her illness from her family, Leah's obsessive and destructive behavior worsens and recovery seems impossible. Leah's relationship with her stepmother, Jennifer, is also complicated. But Jennifer's nine-year-old daughter and Leah's stepsister, Emma, is one of the only things that keep her feeling happy. Leah has been struggling with eating disorders for quite some time and none of the help she received has made much of a difference. Leah finds it difficult to get close to her father and stepmother because they previously brought her to a hospital to recover. Soon, Cassie's ghost starts haunting Leah. This makes Leah feel guilty for not picking up the phone that night and not being there for Cassie when she needed it most. Leah believes that if she had picked up the telephone, Cassie would still be alive. As Leah's self-harm becomes increasingly worse, Cassie's haunting becomes more aggressive. In an act of desperation, Leah goes to the motel room where Cassie died and swallows a handful of sleeping pills in an attempt to block out her voice and get some rest. Because Leah's weight is so low, she ends up waking up in the hospital, finally realizing that she actually wants to live. 